How's it, how's it going guys? I'm Electro HD and today I'm going to give give you a tutorial on how to make this the screen shake or wiggle effect on um After Effects. This this effect's pretty good for you know, you know like montages, um one clip edits, stuff like that. Just gives it a good good look to it if you if you're doing it on like a maybe on like a good Twixter or a, um say uh motion tracking like um yeah so let's get started and actually sorry before we get started um let's say sorry I haven't uploaded in a while guys just been busy with stuff making a dual charge um especially yeah, that should be out soon and then I'll start uplo uploading some more so yeah, here we go um alright what you wanna do is gonna go up here gonna composition new um make it one twelve eighty seven twenty and make this thirty frames per second just it just gives a better quality um and what you're gonna do what what you're gonna wanna do Gonna go put your clip in. Here we go. All right, here we go. My clip's all set up. Um. Okay. First off, um, click on the um. Click on your clip in the um composition. Click. Go ahead and click P. And then Alt. You want to Alt click the little stopwatch. And you want to type in wiggle. Um. Bracket. One. Diff one comma fifteen. I reckon that's like the best setting um for the for this um for this part of the uh, wiggle effect. Like it what it does it moves the screen left, right, up and down. And then to make it go on like a tilt, um click R on the um the clip in the composition, then Alt click the stopwatch and type wiggle bracket one comma three and then close bracket and that puts it on a little little bit of an angle so now as you, this black line it was easy fi easily fixed um what are you gonna do you can either drag it out which doesn't look the best or you go ahead and click type in motion tile motion space tile into the effects and presets and drag that onto your clip and then you're gonna type in um, 150 on output width and 150 on output height and then mirror edges um, now with, I don't know what what happens here it's mine's doing this for some reason but if that happens to yours as well you can always just drag it out a little bit and just bring it up right to the edge so that every other time it won't do it anymore so then you just if you go through that a little bit, oh, you might have to drag it a bit more. Um, here we go. Let's drag that back. There we go. Um, that doesn't happen on this side. It's just weird. I guess I think. Um, there you go. Uh, my thing's really laggy since. There we go. My thing's it's really laggy since I got. A lot of stuff open, so sorry about that. But yeah, you can just play through that, and you can see it. Well, it, it gives it a good effect. It's a bit blurry, but um, yeah, it just gives it a good effect. And then um, what what you can do is you can actually animate the rotation. So go back into effects and presets and type in um slider control. Let's drag that onto your clip. Then on the um below your clip it should say rotate well if it hasn't click R, get the rotation up and it should already be like this. And then grab this little bell, drag it onto the slider part underneath the side control, and that just animates it. So then you drag it back to the beginning, type say one, yeah, let's go one, beginning, keyframe it, and then put it into the maybe to the middle, type in three Let's go three, um, and then go back here, and we'll type in, type in around around, type in around one, or maybe you can go back to two, and then it just gives another, uh, again another better, a little bit of a better effect, and um, so yeah, guys, that's basically it. And if you, um, go ahead and comment in the in the um comments below, or inbox me on my channel. Um, I kind of would like to see one of Vegas tutorial, Cinema 4D tutorial, either of those, um, 
I use all those product uh oh, sorry others so I can give you to any on anything you want. Um so yeah, um thanks guys, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, do all that stuff and I'll see you in my next